Wednesday morning, everyone. It is 9.59 and it's been eventful since about seven. Okay, let's go back to Monday. On Monday, my husband was home. We planned to keep the kids home and Junior got sick to his stomach. So he had like a 24 hour stomach bug. He was vomiting, all that stuff. Yesterday was Tuesday, kids went to school fine. Junior felt fine, came home did everything normal, they had dinner, and then around 7 p.m. Kaylee started saying her stomach was hurting, and by around 7.30, she was vomiting. So, she is, she's been vomiting all night. She is home today from school. Um, I took Junior to school this morning. Uh, my husband's car overheated, so we had to take it back to the mechanic. It was at the mechanic last week. The kitchen is a disaster because I was up all night dealing with her. She was vomiting, not feeling well. I um, didn't get the kitchen done. I wanted to get our video up. It was, it was a mess. So she is cuddled up on the couch. She's got some saltines that she's nibbling at. Um, she's feeling a little better this morning, but she was still throwing up. And she's cuddled up and she's watching Netflix. I'm making myself some cream of rice for breakfast. I'm gonna add bananas to it. And then I'm going to get cleaning. But so far, that's my day. Yeah, my husband's car broke down. I had, we had to drive him to work. So that's the day so far. Okay, so Kaylee's has not thrown up since right before her shower at like 8 this morning. So I'm making her some chicken soup. I just have two chicken breasts in here boiling up with some um, like chicken cubes, chicken broth cubes, I guess, bouillon. So I'm gonna get that boiled up and then I will pull the chicken out and cut it up, add some pasta and vegetables and give her a little bit and see if she can hold it down. So here's Kaylisa's soup. I, does anybody else do this when it's really hot? Add an ice cube to it. My grandmother always did that. So I just used some pasta and chicken and a little bit of mixed vegetables. And I added salt, pepper, garlic. Should be good for her. I don't put too much pepper because I don't want it to be too spicy. So I'm just giving her a little bit at a time. How you feeling? A little bad. A little bad. I'm give her a little bit at a time to see what she can stomach. Eat slowly, okay? Slowly, but it's hot, so make sure you blow it, okay? Okay. And this, this is the pasta I added. It's this um, gluten-free brown rice pasta because I want to eat some soup too, and I'm gonna, in case I get sick, I'm probably going to store some of this in the fridge, but I made a big old pot, so I don't know if we're going to have that for dinner. I pulled out chicken to make dinner, but we might have soup for dinner. But yeah, I got, I threw the whole bag in here, so I might need to add a little bit of liquid later. I don't know, um, but it's, looks good. I'm going to add some pepper to mine, and I'm going to have a bowl. All right, guys, so it is, let's see. 4.25. Usually by this time we'd be leaving for dance today, but since Kaylee's is sick, she's obviously not going to go to dance. Junior is home. He did his homework. He did his reading. And he's in his room having a little bit of iPad time while I... Kaylee's is also laying in her bed watching her iPad. I'm trying to get some liquids into her if um, she didn't really eat much of her soup and then she threw it up. And if she can't keep the liquids down, I think I'm gonna go ahead and take her either to urgent care or to her doctor, if her doctor's still open. But I'm trying to get her to drink some water because she seems better after she napped. So we'll see. But I'm gonna actually do some schoolwork and myself and I'm um, just gonna relax on the couch a little. I did some cleaning before and I'm just feeling weak probably because I haven't slept good at all. <laughs> I mean, Monday I didn't sleep good because Junior was sick, and then last night Kaylee's was sick. So. Mm -hmm. 
looking at my planner and if you haven't seen my plan with me it is up I will link it um, and I had to cross this out because she's sick and that and I say cross that out because he was sick so it's just one of those weeks um, hopefully I'm gonna have to change things up I don't know how I'm gonna do this but I guess we will figure it out Jinger has something to say. What was that, Jinger? Yeah. What was that? No, nothing. Not anymore. Not anymore. <laughs> he's hungry. He told me like 12 times. He's hungry. Okay. It's 7.30. I cooked up some chicken breasts for my husband. And I just pan fried them. And I've got the rice cooker on making him some rice kids and I ate soup and I packaged up the rest. This one I'm going to keep in the fridge. These two I'm going to stick down in the deep freezer. So I packaged them in a plastic. These are from the Dollar Tree. And then I put them in a freezer bag and I labeled it. So those will be good for if I get sick or anything like that. But I've got a little bit of a mess going. But we've got to go. I have the kids ready for bed. Kaylee's ate almost all of her soup for dinner and she had a few bites of a grilled cheese and um, she's drank a good amount of water right now she's having water with a little bit of flavor enhancer and as a treat but she says she's feeling better so I think she can go back to school tomorrow and hopefully me or daddy do not end off with this tonight but I'm gonna head out and go pick up my husband and see what the mechanic said about his car. I don't know how long it's going to take or anything. He's been busy, so I haven't talked to him today. So, Junior, that's enough. So, I'm going to head out now. <laughs>